Well, Joy, since we didn't have a whole lot of luck with kit cars, what's new in the world of manufactured autos? Well, John, things are moving at AMC. In or out? Both. The AMC Concord and Spirits are moving out, mm -hmm. and another version of the Renault Alliance is moving in. Mm, how different is going to be? Well, not a lot. It's a new addition, which mm. they've codenamed the X37. And it's going to have front-wheel drive like your regular Alliance, and what I'm calling it is Son of Pacer. As you can see, it's got that similar distinctive bubble-type hatch in the back, and then to soften and round it out, they've added wraparound taillights. They're going to offer you a two- and a four-door version, and I'm going to reserve my opinion of that bulbous hatchback. I will applaud it for roominess, though, because I'll tell you, when you get in it, you're going to feel like you're in a station wagon. Now, don't look for any major changes in the engine. It has the same mechanics as the Alliance, which is a standard 1.4-liter four-cylinder engine with a five-speed manual or a three-speed optional automatic. Now, it's designed to get you 40 miles to the gallon, and that makes it a little bit more attractive. Yeah, it does, because these pictures are really strange. Well, I know, but you know, once you put on the paint and trim, I think that's going to be as handsome as the Alliance. Now, all of this is part of AMC's plans, because they want to get out of the two-wheel drive business, and they're going to concentrate on their four-wheelers. Now, Renault is going to take over that two-wheel drive business. Now, the car we've just seen will be debuting in France as the R11. We don't have any word on what they're going to call it when they bring it to the United States in the fall. Now, not only are they dropping the Concorde and the Spirit, mm -hmm. but they're also dropping the Renault 18i sedan and Le Car. Hmm. The 18i wagon will remain, but you're going to have a new name for that. They're going to call it the Renault Sports Wagon. Hmm. Since you mentioned the uh, four-wheel drive business of AMC, any changes there? Now, that's interesting. There's only one change, because they're going to come out with a new downsized Jeep XJ series. Oh. The XJ is being designed to be a smaller, lighter companion to the Cherokee and the Wagoneer. Now, AMC created that XJ specifically to compete with the Chevy S10 Blazer and the Ford Bronco 2. Now, you're going to get two versions, as the four-door or the two-door. And as you can see from these spy photos, that boxy styling is very similar to the Range Rover. The engine will be AMC's new 2.5-liter four-cylinder with a Chevy-built 2.8-liter V6 as an option. And rumor has it that AMC will put in an optional diesel six months after production begins. A four- or five-speed manual transmission and a three-speed automatic will also be available. The XJ is going to come in a thousand pounds lighter and five inches lower than the Cherokee and the Wagoneer. And another good thing is that the rear is going to sport a plastic lift gate, and it's hinged at the top. This means it'll be the full height of the vehicle all the way down to the bumper. Well, AMC is certainly slimming down their lineup. Thanks, Joyce. Keep us up to date. Now let's go over.